Hey, it's my last episode of 2015, and I'm hoping I can give out some green grades. Welcome to the Final Wager. I'm Keith Williams. We've got two returning players today. We've got Johnny, our very charming champion, with 9,600 in third place. Ashley, we've got dinged on that lunar landing clue on Tuesday. She's in the lead, 20,600. Sandro, whose accent I loved as well. Actually, I loved all three players tonight. He's got 10,800, just enough to avoid... Uh, a lock situation for Ashley. That daily double on coins, uh, every so often I'm convinced that the writers are confused, that they're not writing for Kids Week, and you put a freaking Kiwi on a coin, not too many places that's going to come from, and to put that at the bottom of the board, it's just stupid. Okay, let us look at the math here. So Sandro is going to have to double up 21.6. It means Ash is going to have to wait for a thousand. If she is wrong, she got nineteen six, which unfortunately for Johnny is four hundred dollars more than he can get to. He can only get to ninety two hundred or nineteen thousand two hundred. So Sandra's going to want to wager everything. I guess at a bare minimum, ninety eight oh one. Leave some money on the table, Johnny. Zero wager would actually work pretty well for him here. So. Um, yeah, if I'm Ashley, I guess I kept my wager at $13.99. And now I go and watch to see what everyone did. Well, uh, looks like Sandra was in the school of Nancy Zerg wagering. Still didn't matter. Would have been fine either way, I guess. But it uh, kind of hurt me to see Johnny wager everything, especially after he wagered zero yesterday. So Sandro finished in second place. Ashley, congratulations. Fun fact about Ashley's appearances. Back in the era when ties were allowed, you could start at the third podium at the rightmost podium, get into a tie in your first game, and then get moved over to the second podium, and then if you won that game, you'd move over to the first podium. So you'd play at all three podiums in regular play. Now that's not possible because ties are out. But Ashley will, in fact, play three regular games at three different podiums, and uh, I think when Claudia comes back, she'll be able to do that as well, depending on where she gets placed. So, yeah. Congrats, Ashley. Cheers for a great 2015, and uh, a very happy new year to you and yours. It's been a lot of fun going over Jeopardy, talking to people, uh, helping people prepare for their appearances, and helping people understand various aspects of math. And I look forward to even better things in 2016. So have fun tonight, be safe, and we'll see you tomorrow, Friday, here on Final Wager.